Yo, what is up guys? Double Gamer here. And today we're back with some more The Legend of Zelda, the Mission Mish Cap. We're gonna start off from where we left off, you know, that is our profile double. So let's go where we left off at. Um, what happened even yeah. So yeah, we gotta head to the Delawood Shrines with this thing on this with this um guy on our hat. So let's head here. You know, we gotta kill some monsters if we need to get where we're going. So we gotta head this way. And I've been watching some gameplays to this game. Um, we are going backwards, I think, into the game. So, yes, we're supposed to be going, heading this way. So, you know, let's head where we need to go, get going. So, yeah, we're supposed to head over here. Hey, kid, where are you going? That's just the way we get... Oh, okay, okay. So, he doesn't want us heading over there. So, oh, look at our heart crystal. And I'm wondering how we're going to get that, you know. So, yeah, like I explained, there's only 46 of them. And, yeah, we've been doing some more Kirby on our channel, too, guys. But it seems that you guys really wanted some more Zelda. Don't worry, I'll be doing Link to the Past, too. It depends how long the episodes are going to be. So, let's check what's over here. So, yes, we're supposed to head over here. Get wrecked. These monsters really think they can stand against the great and powerful Double Gamer, a.k.a. Link. Okay, we got rid of him. Get rid of all of this. All of that. Oh, we got five Rubens. That's nice. Okay, here we go. Hold on for a moment, my boy. We have stumbled across something important. The woods of missions is very small. You're far too big to meet them now. Hey, how are the missions? Oh, yes. Silly me. Allow me to explain. The human. Okay, so what he's basically explaining, he's gonna. Let me fast forward this. What he's basically explaining is that we jump on the stump and we become small. And then when we become small, we can um, meet, you know, other small things. Here we go. We're doing it. Oh, my God. I think we hold R. No, how do we do this? Boom. Okay, here we go. We got to hold L and R at the same time. I don't know what's going on. Oh, snap. We're sm what the... Whoa, whoa, whoa. We're real small now. We're that little green thing that was just moving. Okay. Uh-huh. So now what is he explaining? If you want to return to normal, stand next to the portal and press R. Okay. This is the minish side that we are in. So we're not big. We're the minish size. So which way are we supposed to be going? Oh, here we go. Oh, look, it's like a little thing right there. But before we know, before we go, you know, let's save our game before we keep moving on into the Minish Village. We saved our game. So let's head on here. Oh, snap. Here we are. Oh, we can't go into the water, so wait for one of those lily pads. I should have jump. Ugh. Okay, here. Okay, there we go. We have to jump, actually. Yeah. Okay, we did it. Okay, now we're back to regular size. Nice. My gosh, those big acorns. Who would want those big nuts? Oh, the oh, hey, yo, that doesn't sound right. Okay, let's keep it going. Keep it going. Go under here. Okay, there. We did it. Minish Village, guys. We have finally made it to Minish Village. Okay, here we are. Minish Village. Hmm, it appears that we have found the Minish Village. Who are these guys? Minish people? Pecoro, 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 Rip, Pecoro, Pecoro. What are these guys saying? Pecoro blade? Are they talking about the Pecoro blade? But that was stolen in the first episode. Uh huh. Yes. Yes, the language is different. He said. Okay. We gotta look around. So yeah, let's do that. Like he said, we should look around. These big acorns for small people. That's crazy. Uh, what is this guy saying? Pecora Potico. That doesn't make sense, but okay. I'll take it. Uh, what's over here? And just let me know, guys, before we keep it going. Just let me know if you want, like, new series on my channel. Don't worry. I got a lot of GBA games that we can be playing. And some Dragon Ball Z, Shin Bandoku, if you guys want to see some of that. But, okay, let's keep it going in the game. Who's this guy? 
A poor old Bacoro copy. Wait, what? A poor old Bacoro copy. Uh, I don't get it. He looks different from the others. So, can't go minish size. Bacoro Bacoro copy. So, I don't get it. Can't go talk to him. And he looks different from the others. So, was he like part of something? I don't know. Let's keep looking around. Oh, oh, can't go there. We'll die. Okay, here we go. Some, okay. This is important. Okay, who's this guy? Hmm, I never seen an outfit like that before. Are you a human? Oh my, it's been quite some time since I've seen humans come here. My name is Fresh Soul. Fresh, okay, I'll call you F. My name is F. I watched the abbeys as well, the shrine to the north. You seem to be having some trouble with our language, don't you? Oh, you know, you're going, guys. Alright, guys. Sorry I paused in the middle of the game. My door opened. I had to get clothes and everything. So, let's keep it going. Okay, you should be able to find one barrel in the house just in the south of here. So, what does he want us to do? Okay. Hmm. Oh, yes. Okay, let's, let's skip all of this. Okay, my name is F. Uh-huh. You seem having some trouble with our language, don't you? You could use a... Jabberna, it will be allow you to understand our tongue. You should find one on the south of here. Okay, so he wants us to get this thing called a Jabberna so we can understand their language or their tongue, I guess. So, it's on the south, so I guess south is this way? I don't know. So, let's head over here. Well, we're supposed to get this thing called a Jabberna. Oh, look at a heart crystal. Oh, they're really important. A piece of a heart. Yeah, two pieces. So, um, hold on guys, BRB. Once again, guys, sorry for I keep pausing. So, they said from south of here, we gotta look for the thing called the Jabinite. And we got one heart piece, um, um, piece, so that's good. And, you know, let's keep heading. Hmm. So... To find this thing they call the Japan up, we can understand their language. So, you know, let's look for it. Uh, look at that shrine. Look at, hear this music. Some good Zelda music right there. It's been a while since, you know, Zelda is such a good old game sometimes, I swear. Mm. Can we push that over here? Try to shake us, but you can't do that. Oh, double. This must be the Japan Okay, we found it. You ate the Jabana. Now you can understand the language of the Minish. Nice. So let's talk to this guy, because he's Minish. So you ate in the Jabana. Now you can understand us. The elder said that humans can no longer see us as they once could. It is amazing that you can see us. Final time. I kept on pausing, guys. I'm very sorry. It's amazing that you can see us. Let's continue with the game. So, okay. So, now we can understand our language, which is really good now. So, yeah. So, this is going to be really interesting in the Menace Village. So, no really, not a lot of action in this game. So, now let's go talk back to the um, leader, that guy. Our ancestor is the Menace Used by the portal between worlds. It brought you to the human world and let's settle in the forest. Alright, so yeah, let's go back to that leader. Um, their elder that they we was talking to earlier. So let's head over here. No, no, he's not in there. Hmm, where was he? Where was he? oh yes, somewhere up here. So let's go Oh oh no, we fell in the water again. Okay, good. No, we're not losing no help. So now let's talk to the guy. So you ate the Jarana. Now you can understand us. Sorry, but I know a little about swords. I'm sure the elder can help you. Oh, the elder guy that we were talking to earlier. Okay, so he wants us to go talk to him about the swords. Maybe the Bakura blade. Maybe that's what we're going to talk about. So we head up here. And we head in here. Excuse me, sir. Oh, you can speak our language. It's been quite a while since we heard outsiders speak our tongue. Oh my god, that sounds so weird. We have little to offer you in these woods, but please enjoy your stay. Thank you for your offer, but we have no time to relax. My name is Elza. 
This is a shout in the we need to break a curse that been cast on Princess of Hyrule. To do it, we need to forge the broken Picaro blade. Ah, yes, and we come here now hoping to forge the blade. Hmm, well, that's what you're after. You need element, you, you'll need four mystic elements. These elements are the crystalline form from Energize of the Sword. So we need four doses of fruit to, um, to make the Picaro blade, you know, fix it. Only by infusing the blade with these energies, you can new blade, you can energize, can a new blade be forged? Okay. Here, give me your map. I can mark where these elements can be found. Okay. Okay, we got one element over here. One element up. So that will be... We'll go up first, where the blue element is, and then we'll go straight down to the green one. Then our final one will be the um the red element. The earth element can be found in the shrine in the for in the in the festival to the north of. Okay, so yeah, okay. Speak fresh. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, guys. So you know our mission. Wait, wait. What is it actually? Okay. Mm hmm Keep going. All right, guys. So we got our mission. We got to find the four elements. I hope you guys enjoy this video of The Legend of Zelda Mishcap. It was a double upload, and I know it's late. It's 8.34. But don't worry. I'll be coming out with another Zelda Mishcap tomorrow because we got to find those four elements. So I'll see you guys when I see you guys. Peace out.